Love you. Not the bag breaking. <laughs> I got Starbucks, got my croissants, like always, and then my coffee, because I need energy, and I feel like my energy is low. I did wake up a little bit late today. I was supposed to get up in the morning and vlog and do all this so that I don't have to worry about, you know, the stores being packed and stuff, but, but as you guys can see as the title, I am doing a hygiene shopping vlog. I'm going to show you guys everything that I get and everything that is good for you to get. After this, I will be going to Target and then um, Marshalls. Maybe. Not sure yet. I'm going to show you guys everything and take you guys with me. So that's what we got planned. Let me go eat this breakfast. I'll come back to you guys when I'm on my way to... show you guys the list that i have for today i don't have that much stuff to grab but a lot of things that i need and need to restock on of course this is by far the things that i need to grab it's in total of maybe 15 items if i'm not mistaken but i'm gonna try to not talk too much because of course i'm going to explain everything more when i go home so I'm going to like get whatever I need to get and then show you guys from there. But um, the first thing we're going to go into is the face. Face wash and lash glue, aquaphor, and makeup wipes. So let's look for that first, which I'm already around this area. And then from there we can forward so the only one that i see here and i see that people use is this cocoa butter formula this one says deep cleanse and brightens i think this is one of the ones that i'll be getting to take off like any oil access to my face so let's just put that in the cart for right now these are the wipes that i use these are ten dollars the neutrogena the difference with using cellular water, which of course I need to buy that as well, but I'm not going to buy it here because I wanted to go to Marshalls and of course they're cheaper, but I like to get the wipes and cellular water for like different times. I don't know, but I like to get both. So I'm going to get the wipes here and then the cellular water at um, Marshalls, which of course they don't have that brand, but they have one that I could like also buy this somewhat like the same so I'm gonna buy just this small one for right now instead of buying the huge one and of course I wanted to buy this because it's good to also apply it on your face here and there so for sure I need to add this on here the next thing Next thing I need to buy is a lash glue. They probably don't have it and I don't see it at all. Of course, this is what I get for not going <laughs> to my Target. Wow, everything is gone. Ain't that nice? Um, but, oh. Here we go. Okay, that's what I thought. I get different kinds every time, but I'm just gonna get this one for right now. But of course, I have before. But I think the last one that I had was purple, but it's like the same thing, so. One thing about Duo um, Lash Glue is one of the ones that I stick by, like forever. That's one of the ones that I really recommend, like for anybody to use. Once you use two coats of that, them lashes will last you for days. Now, we're gonna check all those things off because i already got all of them um now i just need a face wash which i always get the um cetaphil one 
but I want a different one, and if not, I'll just get the same one, but my sister is the one that really knows about these products. Cetaphil has always worked for me. I don't know for you guys. I don't know if it's for, like, sensitive skin, if it works the same, like, I don't know, but that's one of the ones that I get, and I really recommend that one. A lot of people get this one, and I've never got this product, but honestly... I think I'm for sure gonna buy it for the first time and this is the one that I maybe might use like forever moving forward because for someone that don't have any acne in their face I feel like this would be a really good one for me so we just gonna put that one in the cart this is the one that I use and that I really recommend I wanted something different so I'm not even gonna look at any of this this the exfoliating daily scrub i can for sure use this before i actually wash my face and this will be bomb because the one i use as of right now is one that i bought i think at five and below and it's just like a face scrub but for this to be this brand that i always use i feel like it will be a very good one so i did do a quick check with my little sister and she did tell me to get instead of the 10 percent I need to get the 4% because, I don't know, she said somewhat of like the 10% being like, I don't know, it's going to really like bleach my skin and like, oh, I don't know, I don't know, but she said the 4% will be good. I ended up getting this as the brightening scrub like for my face before I wash my face instead of the Cetaphil one, so it's the one I got. Now that we got all of that out the way, we're going to go to body now. I'm already in this section and I know for sure I use um rags of course rags are good but we always need one of these and this is $11 $12 so I don't even think I'm gonna buy it here probably gonna buy it at Marshall's because Marshall's do have one so I'm gonna get it there so let me check that off so that I could get it at and I did put TJ Maxx but I mean Marshall's I always need to restock on this one because last time I had it, I put it in the dirty clothes and I don't know, I guess it didn't get washed because I don't have it. I know I do have this for the body, which is good for exfoliate. This is the dry brush. I already told you guys about this one. So we're just going to add that in there. body wash is the one I had already many times bought so I for sure have to restock on this one if I need to recommend a body wash this is one of the ones that I for sure need you to get because this is um the brightening with vitamin c so if you want your body to glow a little bit and also have you know that brightness to it and just a change I for sure get this um my skin feels totally different when I use this so of course it's more on the expensive side but what can you do you gotta take care of your body so it is what it is I did want it to get the Avino body wash because these smells just like a baby and I for sure I don't know if this is the one that I wanted to get but it still smells like a baby but I don't know if this is the exact one because I could have sworn it was like the bluish one and they do have a blue one up there but that doesn't smell like what I smelled in my Target so I don't know if I should still get it or maybe go to my other Target and buy the actual one that I want but this one still smells good so I like I'm not even tripping and just so that I don't have to be with this back and forth I'm gonna just get this one but this one still smells very very good big jumbo but this for sure will last me a very long time um not because I don't shower but you know it's, it's big so we need to get glove exfoliator which they do have it here but in tj maxx tj maxx or marshall's i think they have like packs that you can get so i'd rather get it there i need to get deodorant and razors of course from here so let's go get that at the moment i was using these but honestly the dove one is one of the ones that i forever stick by because they just smell so good and of course they're cheaper but 
I don't really know which one I should get at the moment. Like, I'm just so indecisive about this. These says clinical proven that these are very good for you. But the thing about these is that when I was using them, it literally takes a little while for my body to, like, get used to a deodorant and really work. That's why I don't really like to switch my deodorant out because I do always stick with these, which these are the Dove ones, but these are really good. Let me see which one I'm gonna get. I need to smell these. Apple Blossom, Peach Blossom, and Rice Milk. I'm just gonna get this one, the Peach Blossom and Rice Milk, even tone one. So, because I can't really smell it, but I just know this one will smell pretty good. These are the razors that I get just because, if you guys don't know, I wax. So I don't need razors to actually shave down there. But as far as my legs, yes, you can buy any razor. It does not matter unless your hair is a different type. But then, of course, I suggest to get men razors. But these are the ones I grab and they're very cheap. I'm going to check that off our list. And as far as... um my body i only need the sugar scrub which that's our marshall's back scrub stick <laughs> i don't know if that's the name but the back scrub for, the, for your back i'm gonna get that in marshall's as well the glove exfoliator as well so as far as the body we're done with that now we're gonna go into our oral These are the ones that I use, and these are only a dollar. So I got three packs of those. Of course, we need to get better with using wipes than using toilet paper. So that's what I use. I'm going to go to a little scanning thing to check the different prices between the toothpaste that I got and which was cheaper. If this one is $5, then I would rather get this one than just getting one toothpaste pack and spending $5 on that. I'm not going to do that. It's just cheaper that way. These are the ones that I use. I don't bleed as much. So I use the honey pot ones and it does says mint in the bottom. The other one did not say mint. So make sure you always get the mint one as well as the washes as well. They have different ones. Let me show you guys. They have this one and this one and then the blue one. I'm gonna get this one. So they mostly took all of the lip balms here, but this is the one that I wanted to get. My sister did get this recently and I wanted to try it. This is the vanilla one and it's lip balm. So they have different kinds right here. Strawberry, vanilla, peach, and grape. So I'm gonna of course get the vanilla one. So I'm in the section for vitamins and this is very important because you guys always have to be taking your vitamins all the time. It's really important. This is the one that I get. As you guys can see, it has vitamins A, C, D, E, Bs, and then bitin and folic acid. So this is the one that I grab. So really recommend it, but I'm not going to buy it today because I already have some in my house the only vitamin that i'm really really looking for is one um for my hair and nails but the ones that they do have that my mom also have is this one this is the one that my mom uses and that most girls use and it's for your hair skin and nails but as i see here they do have an orange and lemon one no this is the orange one so I'm going to for sure grab it because this is really, really good. And my mom does says that it works. So I'm going to get this one. This is the one that I'm going to get for today. And this is actually new to my routine. So I'll be taking these literally every day. This is 
This is everything so far that I have. And most things I need to get um, in Marshalls. So these are all the things. Isaiah. Not the bag breaking. I'm gonna get a sugar scrub for my body. This one, they have it for six dollars. Let's see, brightening sugar scrub. This one will be good as well for six dollars. I think probably gonna get that one, but let me actually smell it first. It smells good. Oh, they have these. <gasps> Shade butter sugar scrub. Oh my god. But the thing about this one, I think maybe if you mix it with water, it would turn to like, you know, like the actual scrub. But right now it just looks like it just moves like salt. Look. I don't know if you guys can see. I'm gonna just get this one for right now. So the next thing that I'm looking for is a back scrub stick. Oh, this is open. I'm trying to see if I find another one. I don't know if it should be open or what, but this one is $5. It says it on there. And in Target, they had it for $10, I think, or $11. Like one of these that's like this. So, once again, you guys see what I'm talking about. So, this is, this is all the ones that they have. And they have different ones, mini ones, this one, this one. And this is the one they have. Oh, and it comes with a loaf for how much? Six dollars. So I'm paying a dollar more just to get a loaf with it. I'm gonna get this one for the price of that one. I can get a loaf with it. So I'm gonna for sure get this. These are also good as well to use for your back. The other thing that I need to get is the gloves, the scrub gloves which that's what I'm in the lookout for. Okay, so here we have it. So we have these three pack for, let's see how much, for $6. So do you guys get what I'm saying? They literally have one pack in Target for $5. And these are so bomb. So I'll be getting this one better because it's pink. Let's check that off our list. Back scrub stick, sugar scrub, um, glove exfoliator. I need um, teeth whitening and a lip scrub, but I don't know if they're gonna have that. Okay, so they don't have any um, teeth whitening here, so I for sure have to get them at five and below. So that's what I'm gonna do. As far as lip scrub, I don't see that they have any as well mm. no they don't thank you you too Today it is 
March 4th, I'll tell you the time, it's 5.34 right now, and it is two days later since the time that you guys seen me. I'm basically going to be doing a whole rundown of all of the products that I got. So the first thing that I will be showing you guys and going over is body care. As far as body wash, I had got these two. This body wash right here, Notarium, this one is the Brightener Vitamin C Body Wash. And it's one of the ones that I really, really love because it's like super smooth on your skin. And it is um, dermatologist tested, so it's one of the ones for sure. The second one that I bought here is Aveeno. This body wash I never bought before, but I remember looking through the body wash section. I remember smelling one that smelled just like baby lotion but this one is the green kind and the one that i smelled last time in my target is a blue kind so i don't know but it somewhat still smells like that it is a daily moisturizing body wash the scent is like super super soft like it's like not doing too much but it still smells bomb so i for sure had to grab going to vitamins this vitamin is one of the new ones that i bought for this vlog just because i've been wanting to find one just like this for hair, skin, and nails for a long time. But every time I try to look for one that has a good flavor, um, it's never none around. So thank God they definitely have this one in orange. And I definitely grabbed it this time because they do always have the strawberry one. But I don't like that one. So never got to grab it. This one is just adding new to my collection. Next, as far as exfoliating gloves, this is one of the ones that I do recommend. I did get this from Marshalls and these are very good to exfoliate your skin, but I exfoliate my skin literally every single time I get in the shower and that's because my stretch marks. Always keeping my skin really prepped and nice and smooth. Exfoliating is always important. I got this deodorant. This is the Dove deodorant. It's one of my favorite ones, the Even Tone. And I did get the Peach Blossom in Rice Milk. I actually don't know how this one smelled because I didn't want to open it at the store, but... This smells very, like, soft. So, I'm glad that I got this one. As far as keeping, like, your underarm bright and stuff like that, that's other stuff that you gotta do. Because mines, I'm still working on mines for sure. And I need to buy some products that could brighten that up. It don't matter what scent, but Dove is where it's at for me. These razors, I did get them from, like, the section that usually be, like, the small bottles, the traveling size. These are only, I think, like, a dollar and some cents. If I'm not mistaken, maybe two dollars or something like that. I do only use razors for my legs to shave because as far as my armpits and down there, I do wax. Next, I did also grab these um, rags. Rags are super important when showering. Why wouldn't you want to get through them cracks, okay? Like, if it's, like, your neck, your ears, like, all the way down there and, you know... <laughs> everything this is this is where it's at rags are always like i buy so many of them and then when they get old i just throw them away and buy more packs i do get these for i think what well, i think these are maybe like if i'm not mistaken a dollar or two dollars next guys i did go to marshall's and bought the brightening scrub this was only literally six dollars and it is a good amount this will last me a super long time and it is heavy sugar scrub is very important because in order to exfoliate your body, you need one of these. So you can buy them anywhere, but I did buy this from Marshalls to save me some money. This is a back scrub, and I did get this from Marshalls. It also did come with a loofah, which I'm super excited about because I did a bang with that one. If you do anything to where your back is just sweating, if you go and doing your daily routines to like, I don't know, just walking around or just stuff in the house, doing things in the house or you go to the gym, like sometimes taking a shower, you cannot get to your back. I sometimes can't, but I definitely can only reach to a certain extent. And then of course I go back here. So it's like, I feel like I'm getting everything, but as far as maybe like really scrubbing and washing your back, I don't think anything could do it better than this and having a stick going up and down your back. This is very, very helpful, and I really recommend that. The last thing for the body, I did get one of my favorite body scrubs. This is by the brand Eco Tools. This is like an exfoliator slash loofah at the same time. And as you guys can see very closely, it does have like that rough 
you know, that rough type of feeling. This exfoliates my body super, super well. So now that we got the body care out the way, we're going to go ahead and go into our face. This wash that I bought new. I know that my little sister does use this and i know that it's always good for of course acne i wanted to get like a new wash because i usually always stick to cetaphil so i decided to get this the panaxol this one is the acne creamy wash and it is the four percent i don't always wash my face like i only really deeply wash my face whenever i wear makeup during the day so this would really like brighten up my face a little bit and of course help my acne sometimes i do have a little pimples here and there so as far as makeup remover i did um buy three things this does says it has witch hazel and coconut oil the wipes that i do use are the neutrogena i do feel like these wipes like really really cleanse my face getting always a liquid type of makeup remover and wipes is always a good combo so make sure you do that also guys i did wanted to get this oil I heard a lot of good things about this oil. It will also take away like any pores that's like stuck on your nose, like anything like that. This will remove it. It says that it deep cleans and brightens your face. And of course, the brand Cocoa Butter is one of the ones that's really, really good. So I had to grab this. Also, I did grab um a brightening scrub from Aveeno. And this is a face scrub. I never tried this brand, but I wanted to get something else than the other one that I have, which is from Five and Below. This is dermatologist recommended. And of course, you cannot use the same exfoliator that you use for your body. You have to get a separate one for your face. Of course, the face is more like always sensitive or anything like that. So don't mix your products just get one separate the next thing that i did grab was aquaphor i personally would use it for any time i want my face to like glow or just like anything like i don't know just to have it real nice and like smooth and stuff aquaphor is one of the brands that you always want to buy as well as for like your lips or anything they have chapsticks and stuff aquaphor is the way to go for my lashes guys i do use the duo lash glue this is one of the ones that i forever stuck by this glues my lashes very well and of course if you want it to last more than a week or maybe just a week um always double coat it like either three times or four times and them lashes are gonna last you for a long time okay no no kidding at all i did recently buy this elf chapstick and this is the vanilla kind i wanted to recently buy this this is four dollars but i wanted to recently buy this because they just came out with their new collection of their chapsticks they do got different like flavors and stuff like that but um always keep a chapstick on you guys chapstick is important so now going to our mouth most importantly, our oral. I've only got two items, and one of the ones is this toothpaste. I got the Crest 3D White toothpaste. This was on sale for like $4.24, I think. So it brings two in here. I bought this toothpaste, I think, a little while ago, and it lasts me a super long time. So I wanted to buy them again because I did run out. And especially when you buy your own toothpaste that only you use, it will for sure last you a super long time because in a house full of people in here, um, using one toothpaste for everybody, it is it's, it's gone like this. I did for the very first time bought an electric toothbrush. This is a 360 Sonic charcoal toothbrush by Colgate. And I did also get this like for the fun because I didn't have one. Got that. These are the two things. I'm going to show you guys the self-care for down there the private area i do use the sensitive dove soap don't switch products very often like always stick to one and stick for that one for like a little bit if you want to switch it you can but just always don't switch right away because then that can make you know your ph balance be a little off one of the ones that i've been using of course is the dove sensitive one and then the honey pot the only time that i stopped using it was the time that people were saying like there's things in there that you don't want to be used in like all the stuff you don't want to be putting it down there like all the stuff that's the time that i stopped using it and i know there's many women that stopped using it um but as far as like using it recently i just have this is the rose kind i feel like this little foam wash is really good as well because all you got to do is get three pumps and they're not really that soapy so like it's like you're not doing the most down there when you're trying to wash it like you just three pumps and use it like that and it is foamy like i said so it's like not too much soap but it's like the right amount and just everything just works 
perfectly fine going on to the period pads i do use these this is the honey pot ones these period pads are 100 percent organic cotton cover regular pads um they do have mint lavender and aloe they do have different kinds depending on you know if you bleed more than other people or if you don't whatever whatever i don't really bleed as much on my period so i only got the two drops the one that i really recommend of course is the mint one because it just feels more refreshing down there when you on your period all the girls can vouch for me for sure so ever since i bought these pads i never went back last thing for down there are for sure wipes baby wipes baby wipes baby wipes they're super important down there is gonna feel a little bit more cleaner so of course, there's times where, oh crap, I'm out of wipes and you have to use toilet paper. But I'm just letting you guys know that stock on them for sure. I know that my wipes are always gone super quick. So I wanted to get three packs this time. I usually always get two, but got three packs this time. And they are only a dollar. Once you go to wipes, you're not going to want to go back. Okay? So yeah, guys, that is basically all I got. I got a lot of items and I of course was waiting for this video to restock on everything that I needed to grab. This will be the end of this video. If you guys love this video, give it a thumbs up and also comment down below what are the things that you use or if you like any of the items that I use or I don't know, like just let me know anything. Thank you guys for watching. I love you guys and stay tuned for my next vlog. Bye guys.